hello you're welcome how to solve this nice algebra problem solution from what we have here we can rewrite this as k raised to power 6 equals to 64 here can be written as 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2, times two. that is 2 multiply itself 6 times which implies we have k raised to power 6 equals to 2 raised to power 6. Then here, let's take 2 raised to power 6 to the left hand side. And we have k raised to power 6 minus 2 raised to power 6 equals to 0 from here. Then we can equally rewrite this as k raised to power 3 raised to power 2 from the law of indices 2 times 3 here will still be 6 then minus also 2 raised to power 3 then raised to power 2 here equals to 0 from here then this follows from when we have a square minus b square which is equals to a plus b into brackets then open bracket a minus b that is here we compare a here as k raised to power 3 then b here as 2 raised to power 3 then what we have in this equation becomes k raised to power 3 plus 2 raised to power 3 into bracket then also open bracket k raised to power 3 minus 2 raised to power 3 close bracket then equals to zero from here that is we have two cases here we have k raised to power 3 plus 2 raised to power 3 equals to zero or we have k raised to power 3 minus 2 raised to power 3 equals to zero from here then solving this first case here this follows from a raised to power 3 plus b raised to power 3 which is equals to a plus b into bracket then open bracket a square minus a b plus b square then what we have here cannot be written as k plus 2 into bracket then open bracket k square minus k times 2 that's 2k then plus 2 squared close bracket equals to 0 from here then which implies this is also k plus 2 into bracket then open bracket k square minus 2k plus 2 square here that's 4 close bracket equals to 0 here then from here we have two cases that is here k plus 2 equals to 0 and we have k square minus 2k plus 4 equals to 0 from here. Then on this side, we have k equals to minus 2. So here we have one resolution there. Then on this side, we have a quadratic equation. That is where a here equals to 1 b equals to minus 2 and c equals to 4 and from the formula which is k equals to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4 ac over 2a then here this becomes k equals to minus minus 2 plus or minus square root of minus 2 squared minus 4 times 1 times 4 then divided by 2 times 1 that is from here we have k equals to minus times minus as plus so we have 2 here plus or minus square root of here minus 2 squared that's 4 then we have 
minus 16 here yeah? then over 2 that is the same thing as k equals to 2 plus or minus square root of here we have minus 12 then over 2 from here that is we can rewrite this and we have k equals to 2 plus or minus square root of 4 times 3 times minus 1 then over 2 which implies here we have k equals to 2 plus or minus root 4 times root 3 times root minus 1 over 2 from here that is here we have k equals to 2 plus or minus root 4 here that's 2 then root 3 root minus 1 we have it as i then over 2 that is from here 2 is common here and we factor it out so we have k equals to 2 into bracket 1 plus or minus root 3 high left here then over 2 here so 2 cancel each other then we have k equals to 1 plus or minus root 3 high so here we have two complex solutions from here then solving from the second case this follows from a raised to power 3 minus b raised to power 3 which is equals to a minus b into bracket then open bracket a square plus a b plus b squared then here what we have becomes into bracket k minus 2 then open bracket k square plus 2k plus 2 squared close bracket equals to 0 from here that is here we have two cases the first one we have k minus 2 equals to 0 and the second one we have k square plus 2k plus 2 square that's 4 then equals to 0 from here that is here we have k equals to 2 on this side then on this side we have a quadratic equation where a equals to 1 b equals to 2 and c equals to 4 and from the formula k now equals to minus 2 plus or minus square root of 2 square minus 4 times 1 times 4 then over 2 times 1 then here we have k equals to minus 2 plus or minus square root of 2 square that's 4 then minus 16 here yeah, over 2 which implies we have k equals to minus 2 plus or minus root minus 12 over 2 and don't forget root minus 12 here yeah, will be same thing as 2 root 3 high from here that is we have k now equals to minus 2 plus or minus 2 root 3 high then over 2 that is 2 is common here we factor it out we have k now equals to 2 into bracket minus 1 plus or minus root 3 high left here close bracket then over 2 here that is here 2 cancel each other so we have k equals to minus 1 plus or minus root 3 i so also we have two complex solutions here then all together we have six solutions from here we have two real solutions and we have four complex solutions making six solutions all together and thank you for watching don't forget this step subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell on share this video give it a thumbs up see you next class and bye for now